I'm Organa. Welcome to Meet Me at the Corner. I'm here at the Great Hall in the Metropolitan Museum of Art. The Metropolitan Museum of Art is one of the largest art museums in the world. You may have read about this museum in the Newbery Medal winner book. From the mixed up files of Mrs. Basil E. Frankweiler, it is a novel by E. L. Koningsberg. Today we're going to speak to Rebecca Rabinow a curator of 19th century European paintings here at the Metropolitan Museum of Art. Today she's going to speak to us about her job as curator and tell us more about this famous museum. How many pieces of art do you have here at the museum? At the Metropolitan Museum of Art, we have over two million works of art that range from 5,000 years from the earliest known artifacts into present day. We're collecting contemporary art as well. What is the job of a curator? There are many different departments at the museum, and so curators have different roles in different departments. Here, with the European painting from the 19th century, our job is to research the pictures and also to exhibit them in a way that makes sense to the public. We're always looking out for holes in the collection areas where we can acquire new works of art to tell a more complete story. We research the pictures, we write about them, we publish them, and we also produce special exhibition using works from our Does the Metropolitan Museum of Art own all the works in exhibit? We don't own all the works of art that you see in the museum. We often have loans that come from other institutions or from private collectors, and similarly, we lend out works to exhibitions all over the world. Could you tell us how someone becomes a museum curator? The best thing you can do is to learn all about the world around you, to study history, to learn other languages, French and German, Spanish, and then to really go and see works of art. So it's a great idea to go to as many museums as you can and to really look around you. For example, the picture behind us is a work by Claude Monet who painted it in the north of France. So to really understand this work well, it helps to be able to read and speak French so you can see what people have written about it. And also you might even want to go visit this spot, which is on the English Channel, and get a sense of what the gardens there look like. Do you travel much in your job? We travel to do research. We travel to see works of art in other collections. We travel to attend conferences as well. Being a curator has a lot of detective work involved in it, and so I am often find myself going different places to use different archives to try to put some of those jigsaw puzzle pieces together. That's it for my corner of the world. See you next time.